Good morning, my name is Joaquin Arboso, PGA Teaching Professional and Head Golf Pro here at DeBell Golf Club in Burbank, California. How unlucky is it when our ball rolls into a bunker off the tee and we're stuck in the fairway bunker trying to hit a shot into the green? After this video, hopefully you'll have a little bit of a better understanding of how to approach this shot and have more confidence on the golf course. Number one, have an understanding that a fairway bunker is nothing like a greenside bunker. A greenside bunker, we're hitting two to three inches behind the golf ball. It's an explosion shot. It's a very aggressive shot through the sand with a ball that's really not traveling too far. But in this scenario, we want the golf ball to travel far. And if we use the same techniques that we do in greenside bunkers, you're gonna actually fail at the shot in the fairway bunkers. If you haven't checked out my video yet on greenside bunkers, click the link on top. It's Conquering Greenside Bunkers, great video for beginners and uh, golfers who are just uh, in need of help out of a greenside bunker. But today, let's talk about the characteristics of hitting a out of a fairway bunker. Number one is you're gonna wanna make sure that you hit more golf ball than sand, okay? Number two, don't be afraid to dig your feet in a little bit. Get a nice, nice base in your stance, dig your feet in, and when you dig your feet in, you have to also remember because you dug that the feet in, you're gonna be lower to the ground, so you're gonna to have to choke up on that club to make sure that we're not bottoming out behind the golf ball, but we're hitting more at the golf ball. Um, and finally, my eyes. I'm looking behind the golf ball. I'm looking right behind the golf ball when I hit this shot, and my goal is to be able to create that divot in the sand at the golf ball and ahead. Um, a lot of you struggle because you take the same concepts that you do on greenside bunkers and you apply them here. Um, also, the technique. A lot of golfers drop that right uh, uh, shoulder, causing the club to bottom out, and now we're two to three inches behind the ball. Great for around the green, but not too great for in a fairway bunker. So make sure you dig your feet in a little bit, choke down on the golf club, make sure that you're looking right at the back end of the golf ball, and remember, we're trying to hit the golf ball before we hit the sand. And as you can see, I was able to get that ball out cleanly. I advanced it and got it on the green here at hole number 16 at the bell. 